Welcome to the CSSN channel. Our topic for today is 17 types of primary headache. My name is Abu Zahd Habib I have an MD degree and I'm the director of the Canadian Academy of Sport Nutrition. Subscribe to the CSSN channel on YouTube to enjoy the information that we share on a regular basis about medicine, weight loss, fitness, and sport nutrition. Okay, headache. Today I'm going to talk to you about 17 types of primary headache. Today you're going to learn what are primary headaches, what are secondary headaches. Globally, headache is among the most common reasons that people seek medical attention. Headache is among the top 10 complaints that people will go to see a doctor, they will go to see a sort of healthcare center. And unfortunately, also headache is one of the most commonly mismanaged symptoms. There are many people out there who suffer from different types of headaches. They keep changing their practitioners, they keep changing their clinics from first one to the second one, from the second one to the third one. They do sort of medical shopping and unfortunately their headaches are still there. This could be because of the fact that the diagnosis hasn't been right at the first place. But let's see what is primary headache and what is secondary headache. In 2018, International Headache Society classified headaches in two categories, primary headache and secondary headache. Primary headaches are those headaches that uh, they have no specific reasons, they have no specific pathology behind them. Basically, uh, primary headaches are not caused by exogenous disorders like migraine, tension headache. Secondary headaches, as you can guess from the name, are those headaches that uh, basically there is a pathology behind them. They happen because something else. For example, if someone has systemic infection, if someone has trauma to the head, if someone has a uh, brain tumor, if someone has an uh, eye problem, they might develop headache and we call them secondary headache. But today I'm gonna talk to you about 17 types of primary headaches. Let's see what are those 17 types of primary headaches. Here is the list of 17 types of primary headache. Today I'm going to list them for you and I'm not going to talk about them in details. Because if I talk about them in details, every one of them, the video is going to be more than two hours and this is something that we don't want. Definitely in the future I'm going to talk about them one by one, about their symptoms and also their treatments. But let's see what are those 17 types of primary headache. Number one, at the first place we have a tension headache. Actually tension headache, they are 69% of a primary headache. So 69% of primary headaches that we see out there, they are tension headache. Then we have a migraine, right? Migraine is also common. Migraine is about 16% of primary headaches. Uh, third place, we have cluster headache. Cluster headache. At fourth place, we have paroxysmal hemicrania. As I said, I'm going to talk about them one by one in the future. Number six, sorry, number five. Number five, it's called uh, hemicrania continua and number six is famous as I'm gonna put in here we call them a uh, sunct number seven is famous as a uh, sona sunct stands for short-lasting unilateral neurology form headache 
C stands for uh, conjunctival in injection. That means uh, when they have this type of headache, they might have sort of redness in their eyes. And T stands for tearing. Uh, actually, these two uh, headaches, um, it happens often that they misdiagnosed as sinus headache. As I said, I'm going to talk about them in the future. Uh, these five headaches from number three to number uh, seven, cluster headache, paroxysmal uh, hemicrania, hemicrania continua, sunk, and sona, they are related to the cranial nerve number five. Cranial nerve number five, it's called trigeminal nerve. That's why in medicine, these five types of headache, it's famous as, we call them tax. Trigeminal autonomic cephalalgias. Number eight. Number eight is primary cough headache. Number nine, primary sex headache. Number 10, primary exercise headache. Number 11, we have a primary thunder clap headache. Number 12 is a primary stabbing headache. This is in medicine we used to call jabs and jolts, but not anymore. As I said, I'm going to talk about them. Number 13 uh, is called a uh, hypnic headache. Number 14. Number 14 is a cold a stimulus headache ice cream headache is here we will talk uh, number 15 is external pressure headache for example those people they wear helmets those athletes they wear goggles they develop headache which is going to be here number 16 in medicine is famous as numular headache and the last one is famous as NDPH. NDPH stands for new daily persistent headache. Now you know the list of 17 types of uh, primary headache. Next week I'm going to talk about primary exercise headache completely symptoms and basically how we gonna treat it we make science easy to understand now you know if you don't want to miss the videos that we post on a regular basis about medicine weight loss fitness and sport nutrition uh, you can subscribe to the CSSN channel on YouTube to support us you can share like or comment on this video until next time that I'm going to talk about primary exercise headache, you stay safe, you stay headache free.